Welcome. Hello. Welcome to the fourth edition of our Lockdown Live concert here from the Lockdown Studio in the center of Germany in the forest. So if it's the first time that you're seeing this, uh, we've taken refuge here for the last two months in this, this really beautiful room. We've brought all of our studio equipment. We've been recording all the music. Uh, and of course, every two weeks, we just pop our heads out to make uh, a little concert for you. So this time, we've done a little bit of a fantasy theme. As you'll see, this is how Florian normally dresses. It's pretty unicorny. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, and... Uh, oh, man. <laughs> so bad. But so, uh, this, is, this is in fact how... Uh, this, this is a special set for you that we're going to be doing today. Uh, it's a bit fantasy inspired, so we will have a mix of music from us that has kind of a folky fantasy vibe, as well as some special treats uh, that you've certainly not heard from us in the past, uh, and one that for Stefan was like a boyhood dream to play. So we're going to start with, uh, to warm ourselves in this room up, even though the fire is doing a very good job. Uh, we're going to start with a song called Rocky Roads to Republic, which was written in Paris, in Paris. and uh, it's um, kind of meant to be a beautiful homage to the importance of Republic to the city of Paris.
Hi. So, my lovely people, for those of you just joining us now, hello, welcome back to the Lockdown Studio. We prepared a special set, as we said, and now we're gonna show you why it's so special. So today the idea was to play music inspired by fantasy, inspired by folk, um, particularly for all of you at home who could not make it to Kelfest. Um, we were supposed to be playing at Kelfest on the 22nd, 23rd, and 24th of this month. And unfortunately that was cancelled along with a lot of other festivals in the fantasy vein that were happening at the end of the spring. Uh, and so this is the closest thing that we get to making those performances. Costuming is perhaps a little bit different uh, than was originally anticipated, but we didn't expect to be doing this or staying in this lockdown studio that long. So this is the best we can do. And honestly, I think Florian, you've done very well, my friend. This is my This is, this is well, how Florian sleeps every night. So if you're looking to sleep with Flo, uh, this is exactly what you'll be experiencing. This is the outfit. <laughs> <laughs> Just hair. It's a magical thing. Um, so, yeah, now, this is the special one for Mr. Stefan. So, one of the things that we've been doing a little bit, when we had some free time, of course, which isn't so often because we work so much, uh, but we like to, uh, to play a game that has a little bit of a nostalgia, uh, for, for, particularly for Stefan, but also for myself. Uh, and that game is called Halo. And Halo was very famous for a long time for having this beautiful introductory song. Uh, when you open the credits, it just makes you want to run with the Spartans and, and take on the Covenant and smash the Flood to pieces. And so, uh, we realized that for nostalgic reasons, not only nostalgic reasons, but also uh, if this song fits very well into uh, our own music. And so, We've made a, a small adaptation, if you will, of some of the music from Halo, and we want to play that for you now. So, it starts a little something like this. I want to dedicate this song to my lovely brother Martin. We spend a lot of hours playing these games, and I hope when I'm back in Austria we can play again, my brother. Yes, man. You can be my Halo. Halo. Mm -hmm.
So while we make a quick uh, equipment change, Florian, the, the unicorn guitarist, the Einhorn, the unicorn. Uh, Florian is going to be uh, switching over to the old electric guitar, but really, the most important <laughs> instrument that he does in fact play in this song is the tambourine. Um, and he has now a brand new yellow tambourine. Just got it. We are with the yellow tambourine. That's right. Yellow tambourine. Jiggling. And friends are all aboard. Right. Our guitar is unicorn. <laughs> and the band begins to play. <laughs> so, so yeah, so this is a, a, a rather new song from us. If you saw the third, uh, third edition, third lockdown edition, we debuted in public uh, for the first time. And it's a song that we really love. Um, but it still has a working title right now called The Pyramid Stage. So right now we still uh, we still haven't changed that title yet. So if you have a good idea by the end of this song of what the name should be, go ahead, uh, send a little comment. How about you boys? We'd like to know what it is uh, because we're uh, we're still not sold on any of the, our, our own ideas. It's, sometimes it's easier to write music than it is to name. It. That's true. Yeah. <laughs>
Now, that was fun. We want to turn to a brand new song. This is a debut for us. Um, the song that we wrote in an area of the world that we've spent quite a bit of time the last two or three years. Um, so since 2017, some of you might know, um, we've become very partial and fallen in love with a series of families uh, and friends and the landscape and the place that is uh, and that are in Provence. Uh, and so since the end of 2017, we've been going to Aix-en-Provence um, and we met a very a beautiful couple and their daughter Marion, Marie and Jude, as well as uh, Denis Lisette and his family as well. He has a lot of kids uh, and he is also become and has become a very close and dear friend to us. Um, our brother, who you've probably seen writing at some point, if you're a, a trouble follower, Mr. Fabien as well. Um, he lives in Marseille, but he's from Provence. And so we have a lot of friends. Uh, there's a lot of missing as well, or not naming, uh, but we have a lot of friends in the area who have really become a part of our band and our story. Uh, and so we wrote a song that's dedicated to this, this area. Um, and uh, it has kind of a swingy vibe, if you will. Um, but there's, yeah, it's called the X Factor, like X from <laughs> the two ones. Or you know, P90X. <laughs> or P90X for Stefan. There's so much you can do with it. Uh, but yeah, and we hope you enjoy it. So this is the first time that we're playing this song. Uh, if you know how to swing, it's a good time to do that in your living room or outside or wherever you are. Just, just throw a couple swing moves in there. Boogie for us. Uh, and uh, we're going to do the same up here. So this song is called X Factor or P90X en Provence. <laughs>
for the last few months. Uh, it was just before it happened. We were in Berlin. They were just starting to implement measures. And we went out into uh, Volkspark in Friedrichshain, which is an area where most of us more or less live. And um, we... You mean we live in the park? We don't live in the park, we live <laughs> in Friedrichshain. That's You meant me, dude. Yeah, yeah. Ollie, Ollie does live in the park. I, don't know I won't tell you which bench exactly, but it's one of them. Okay, my uh, knowledge for the park. <laughs> But so, so, so we went into this park and on, on the fly we created uh, this improvisation that uh, was our 2020 St. Paddy's Day song. And so we, we liked it so much that we thought, why don't we take that and kind of make an even better version for you now. So this is uh, kind of a, a Paddy's improvisation, if you will, uh, that 
we've we hope you enjoy it. It really has that sort of kind of feeling. <laughs>
ladies and gentlemen. This is the moment where we tell you we've only got one song left in the set. You need help, everybody. Yeah, this is really tight. <laughs> the car comes in. Yeah. Bombs, okay. So this is that part where we tell you it is the last song that we're going to be playing. But before we uh, we leave you with this last song, we want to do something very. Uh, we want to say thank you again. Uh, this is the fourth lockdown edition, the fourth lockdown concert that we're doing, and um, it's been it's been very important for us. You know, while we've everything that we're working on here behind the scenes is you know writing new music, preparing for releases that we're going to be making in the future. We wrote an entire story. Hopefully, we're in the process of writing a second one. We're mixing a, a, an album. Uh, there's a lot going on here behind the scenes for us. Um, but all of that is for the future. And um, essentially, we've lost so many concerts up until August uh, that it's a huge help when you contribute to us, either by becoming a patron or by donating to uh, through our website for these lockdown concerts. This is literally how we're paying our rents and surviving and, and eating and, and everything. So um, we just want to say thank you for all of you that have donated either in the past or even right now uh, throughout this show. This is a huge help. It's really what helps keep the lights on for us. Also, of course, streaming and downloading and listening to music and sharing things when you see them. I mean, this is also, this brings us a, a little something as well, which helps for the future. And I want to talk about that just for one second, the future, yeah? So we, as we've said a few times, we wrote this story and we're going through the process of finalizing it, uh, of finishing really all the character development, writing the story, and of course also mixing and eventually mastering the songs. And there's some singles that we're going to be releasing over the next months, but we have this big dream to, to make an animated series with some of these stories, with this story and also another one that perhaps is going to have a little bit more of a fantasy vibe. Um, and so the way that we're going to do that is, is starting next month, we're going to set up um, kind of like a pre-sale or a, almost like a crowdfund. Uh, where what we're asking for is we're not asking for a lot of bands ask for money in order to be able to record But we've done that here um, And so what we're hoping to be able to do is use that money to invest into kind of like the the marketing and creation of this video series that we want to make um, And so keep an eye out for that um, If you're already a patron, you're going to be knowing about it. Um, I can't reiterate Patreon enough because it's, uh, it's very important to us. We also have a Telegram community, like a group chat, uh, where we can keep in touch with one another. But if you're like, okay, Patreon, I'm not ready for that, and Telegram's a bit too much, um, if you want to get in touch with us with email, that would be amazing as well. Our email is thetroublenotes at gmail.com. Um, and if you just send us a quick email now, for example, uh, we'll put you in our mailing list, or we'll also post something here in the chat right now uh, that will let you sign up for the mailing list and then we can send you emails about these releases and Sort of what we're hoping to be able to accomplish with some of this stuff so you get more detail if you're interested um, Because we need you in order to be able to, to make this possible because we still want to do it independent of You know a major label or anything crazy like that and we could do this of course But right now for us we think that we want to be able to to do it ourselves and keep it independent so any help uh, that you can provide, whether it be helping us share the music or whether it be actually directly contributing is very welcome and we appreciate it greatly. So now we want to play our last song of this, this set uh, and it's called Barney Rubble and it's a perfect one to end on because whenever we play at a fantasy festival, this song is the one where we get all the pirates are and, and we get... <laughs> <laughs> we get all the Star Wars people starring, and everybody's just having a good time and dancing around and going nuts. So this song is called Barney Rubble, and if you, you haven't gotten you yet to jump around your living room, now is the time. This is the time to break something. Don't worry if it breaks. You'll feel good about it afterwards because you just you lost control and you danced like crazy. So this song is called Barney Rubble. It's a whole heap of fun, and uh, we hope you enjoy our set tonight as well as, um, yeah, all of this new music that's coming out in the future. So let us know your thoughts and comments about the songs that we debuted, and hopefully, um, yeah, we hear from you soon. So this song's Barney Rubble. Yeah. Get ready to dance. Before I comes up in May. Fourth of May. Fourth of May. This is the fourth. 
off live stream. And we do it in May. Sure.
edition of the Lockdown Concert. It has been a pleasure. Thank you for your donations. Thank you for supporting us. Thank you for sharing. And we'll see you soon. We've got another one in two weeks' time from two weeks from today. It's going to be another little special one, something different from the other ones. Uh, we'll let you know what exactly that is. Um, but probably going to have something to do with some personal influences from us. Each one of us picking a song, maybe, uh, and uh, preparing something special. So it'll be a different set each week, each two weeks, different set. And also, as we said, sign up for our mailing list, become a patron, join the Telegram chat, uh, and hopefully uh, keep in touch with us and listen to some great new music in the future. So lots of love. See you soon. And uh, have a great day. Have a great week. Woo! Woo! <laughs> uh, outro for Kelpass? Oh, that's funny. Uh, Kelpass, yeah. Uh, Kelpass. Yeah, let's do it. Let's Alright, go. Weapon. Hold on. Let's do it. Uh, what's going on in the technical issue? What's going on? Ah! Oh, okay. I'm <laughs> So, Kelpass, we want to thank you very much for watching our set. Uh, this was the best thing that we could do to get closer to you. Hopefully, we'll be seeing you in the future at the next year, Kelfest, and uh, we, we look forward to dancing around, jumping around with each other, and just having a great time. So be safe, stay wonderful, stay weird. Wash your hands. Wash your hands, uh -huh. and we'll, uh, <laughs> we'll see you all soon, yeah? Lots of love. Thanks, Kelfest. Wash <laughs> you know, your dang. Yeah, that was the first thing that comes to my head. Not good. Nice job, bitches. Nice. So much good energy, so nice.